How's it going, guys? Kicking the fourth quarter here. We're back with another episode of our Minnesota Timberwolves, my GMO. So right now we're sitting at 10 and 3. Just lost this game against the Celtics. Uh, that we I don't think we shouldn't have lost, but we did. And now the next game is against the Mavs. I said I was gonna play this one, but then I thought about it. This team is not worth playing, so what we're just gonna do is just gonna sim cast it. And we're going to see how Kobe does. If you guys didn't watch the last episode, Kobe is on this team, 40 years old, still in the league, still trying to win a championship, and he's in Dallas. Dirk is gone. Um, I can't remember who else is on their team. I think Hassan Whiteside is on there, then Justin Anderson. So they had a couple solid pieces, but you can look right now, we're just, we're just starting to tear them up. Like we're going to win this by over 20. Can I make it fat? Yeah, there we go. So we won by almost 30 points. Car Anthony Towns. Put up a 20 and 16 game. Wow, that's ridiculous. Um, oh, that's not good. When did Eric Woods get injured? Uh-oh. I didn't get an update about this. Oh no, yes, last episode. Last episode we found out he was injured. I'm I'm that was so long ago. Like the way I do this, guys, I record like three or four episodes in one day, and then for the next week or two, I just don't play at all. Um, so that's the reason I just forgot about that. Eric Woods is injured for a couple weeks. Okay. Um, makes sense. So in this episode, we're just going to do some simming and try to keep our fans happy, keep the team happy. Uh, ben McElmore wants to play more, but I don't think I got any minutes for him. So we're just going to let him uh, stow over there. And we're just getting more Ws, man. I think I put together a really good team. Darren Collison in the first round pick for Wiggins, our franchise player. No, thank you. I don't care how many first round picks you're going to throw at me. Wiggins is going to be on this team to stay. And we're just destroying people. We're not going to do this trade either. Um, Mo Williams is old, and I think Zach Levine is actually playing really well this year, so I definitely don't want to trade him. Um, something's happening. Okay. Uh, he's recovered from his sore back. I didn't even know he had a sore back. He was still in the rotation. But, hey, we'll take it. Evan Fournier must be playing terrible. He's shooting 31%. That's terrible, guy. Um, we're going to let him try to shoot. Actually, you know what? We're going to take Evan Fournier's minutes a little bit. Since he's not playing so well. And then give him to Ben Macklemore since he's on fire and he and he's complaining about his minutes. So hopefully that'll um kind of kind of average him out just a little bit. And now we're still winning games, dude. I swear, we're gonna go for the repeat. I can't think of a team that can beat us right now. Especially not in a seven game series. This is almost impossible. But another update. Are we playing against Bradley Bill? No, thank you. We don't need to make any changes for Brad. Oh, we should have made changes for Bradley Bill. Let's see. Was he the reason we lost? Should I have made some changes? God. Am I that dumb? Let's see. Um, Bradley Bill dropped 26. We didn't make any changes. He dropped 26, and we called an L. Uh, ben McMore, 17 minutes, 16 points, 13 free throw attempts. Wow. Okay, maybe we should be giving him more minutes. That is ridiculous. Where where can we get him more minutes from? Um, let's see. Jimmy should get more minutes, it seems like. What is he doing? Everybody's on fire. Look at this. Jimmy shooting 42%. Zach Levine shooting 47 Our starting five is on fire. And there's there got to be some minutes somewhere. Evan Fournier shooting 29%. Wow. Um, let's let's try to make a deal, man. Um, I, I don't want to mess with chemistry too much, but I think me trading Evan Fournier won't be too bad considering um he is a low on the bench. We got three first round picks this year. I don't know where I got these picks from, but we got the Magic and the Warriors pick. Let's see if any one of those picks is gonna be worth anything. Um, so let's go to conferences. The Warriors, of course, they're still doing pretty good. And what was that? The Magic. The Magic. Oh, that Magic pick can be a top five pick. So we're keeping that one. We, If we want to trade anything, we're going to trade the other two. It'd be great to get some more youth on an already youthful team. I, I don't know, man. That'd be great. Um, I'm already thinking about the offseason when we're still early in this season. I'm, I'm, I think I'm getting a little ahead of myself. But let's see what we can get for Evan Fournier. I'd like to get another wing player that can actually play. <laughs> Joel Embiid, we're, we don't care about, even though that would increase our team a little bit, we can get Contavious back. Contavious spent a little while with us, but he's one of those guys that complains about his minutes a lot, so I don't want that. Um, Joe Green, no, no, even though he, he can bring some experience, I don't like him as a, look, okay, timeout. Trades like this are so unrealistic, I would never do something like this. I mean, I don't. I like to make mine as, as realistic as possible, but still keep it entertaining. But this is just ridiculous. Not Rudy Gobert, man. That's that's not going to happen in real life. But I don't think we have any solid trade offers for Evan Fournier, so we may just have to keep him on the team, which is not terrible either. We just keep the minutes. Um, Let me see. I want to see what this pick is worth. How many stars is this pick worth? It's got to be worth at least three because that team's terrible. 
What if we can get an all? And should we get a superstar? Should we trade Corey Joseph? I know he's been playing solid for us, but can we get a? I know Zach Levine is solid, but we if we can get like an all star point guard, that'd be ridiculous. Oh, it's only worth two stars. Maybe because it's early in the season. Um, let's package those two picks. I'm just playing around. Um, the way I'm gonna be doing this in the next couple episodes, probably me just toying around, trying to make this team better. It's already good. We only got four losses on the season, fifteen to four. But if you can get better, why not? Why not get better? So we're gonna try to package in those two picks, and uh, hopefully we can get. Look at this. What? Throw away our two picks and Corey Joseph for Josh Smith? No, thank you. Um, Derek Favors? No. Okay, they, there's not a lot to offer. Oh, I knew this is gonna happen. Um, recent trade discussions. Uh, this is tough for me. I'm all right. Who cares? Okay, let's make this. Um, is everybody happy right now? He's feeling anxious, Ben Macklemore, but who cares? Um, just keep doing your thing and you'll, you'll be all right. So I'm trying to think of the next, where we're going to send to. I, we started off right here, November 26th. So we should go, let's go about a month. So December 26th is where we're going to stop. Um, I'm trying to see if there's a team we want to, we want to watch the simulation go on. Try to find a good team in here somewhere. The Jazz, no. The Cavs don't have LeBron anymore. LeBron is right here. We're going to simcast this Lakers game since LeBron is in LA. And uh, hopefully we can keep getting victories. Um, is ready to discuss his extension. Okay, no, I'll do that right now because I love Zach Levine. Why not give him an extension? So let's let's talk about it. Let's talk about it with uh, Zach Levine. I'm hoping he, he's not going crazy and he wants a big amount of money. Um, we're going to promise him an extension because I do want to keep him. And that helps his uh, morale a lot. And then let's go to contract extensions. We'll resign back. What does he want, though? This is the big part. What does Zach Levine want? Won a championship leading this team. Not leading, but the starting point guard. Okay. Huh. This is not too bad for what he's going to develop into. He's still just like 20, 22. He's like 22 right now. So he still has a lot of potential. Giving him nine a year. Um. Let's see. Let's see if we can get it down just a little bit. Let's get it. Uh, yeah. Let's see. Let's see if he'll take that. Um, did he? I don't even know if he accepted. I didn't even read that. He accepted. Okay. So Zach Levine is tied up for another couple of years, which is great. We want to do the same thing with Wiggins. I think he's gonna resign. I think he's one of those loyal guys. Um, let's see. Extremely loyal. So we're good on him. Car Anthony Towns, extremely loyal. Corey Joseph. He's just, he's new to the team, so I don't expect him to say something like extremely loyal. And I think my game just froze. All right, so Corey Joseph is loyal. Most likely going to be interested in reciting, which is cool. Um, Alex Lynn, loyal. So we got some some guys on their last deal, or last year to deal. Not sure if we're going to keep everybody, but at least everybody said they're willing to resign if they have the choice. That's always good. Um, let's get back to the schedule. Um, so let's get to this Lakers game. Yeah, that's the game we want to go. go. Um, so we seem, we seem to still be getting victories. I don't know what this means. The game play of the Minnesota Tim was against the San Antonio Spurs. Needs adjustments before it's used. This would be due to injuries or roster changes. Yada, yada, yada. I don't care. I like, I don't know what that even means. It, it happens whenever I go against them or the Spurs or OKC. That happens every time. See, they're not even tell. I don't know Jimmy was injured. Nobody told me Jimmy was injured. But hey, he, he was injured. Okay, but he's back. Um, doesn't seem like he missed any time, but he was just out there aching. Jimmy plays through his injuries, if you didn't know. It seems like somebody else just, just got injured. I don't even want to look. I'm going to look away. I'm just going to look away. Oh, he's back. Eric Woods is back. Yes. Okay. So what we're going to do, um, Myers Leonard has been playing very well, but Eric Woods is our start and center. So we're going to take... um. Evan Fournier is five minutes away from him. I like Tyus Jones a lot, man, but he he just doesn't get the time he deserves. So we're not going to touch his minutes. We're going to keep him at 14. We're going to take some of Gorgie Dangs and then Alex Lenz. Um, this is our starting power four right here. So who else can we take? Uh, Macklemore, he's been still playing okay. We're going to take some more of Miles Leonard's and then take one of theirs. So... I don't know, man. They want me to keep 
um miles leonard in the starting lineup which i'm not completely opposed to their overalls are very similar but i i think i like eric wood starting like he's been playing so well when he was playing 13 games averaging 12 and then shooting 54 percent i like that a lot um man we gotta find some more minutes somewhere I said I was going to take your minutes, Tyus. I'm sorry. We got to, man. We got to for the good of the team. It seems like you'll be okay with it. There we go. Get Eric Woods up. Help him develop a little bit. He's upset to the fact that we haven't extended his contract. Well, we tried to, and he wasn't even ready. We'll resign back. Let's just give him what he... Okay. What is he going to ask for? If Zach Levine at overall 80 wanted 9 mil, I'm thinking Wiggins wants like 15 a year. He wants 22 a year. Oh my god, come on, Wiggins? Twenty-two a year for Wiggins. He's a ninety overall now. And he's still young, so I do think he will get better. Oh man, this is twenty-two a year. I He doesn't think we're on the same page. Let's let's try to edit the offer. I want to keep him. He is our franchise player. Let's offer him what he wants. Not quite looking for the. Okay. Um. Come on, Wiggins. You got it. You got to meet me somewhere in the middle. Okay. I'm scared that he's eventually going to say screw this. I don't want to play here anymore. So let's give him four point five. Oh, sixty four point five. Wow. He's money hungry. But it says right there he wants to be he's a five stars loyal, but only two stars money hungry. But look at him. He's he's denying all these offers for one million dollars. Come on, Wiggins. Fine, I'll accept the offer. It'll be shut up. Ugh. He just broke our pockets. Let's go look at um Where do I go see money? Oh Okay, I really can't find where I can look at my budget for next season, but that's okay. Um, we just paid him a bunch of money. Hopefully, that doesn't come back and bite us. If it does, oh, that'd be tough. Um, Jimmy put up a 28 piece and Wiggins put up 21. Trying to pay, let us know that uh, he deserves that money. We just paid him. He's only 22. So, when this deal is over, he'll be like 26. And I think he'll just be hitting his prime, which is great. Uh, we just locked him up, even though it was a big deal. All right, guys. So, if you enjoyed the video, be sure to leave it a like, as always. Um, let's look at the standings here. We are 21 and 8 on a two-game losing streak. Uh, didn't end the way we wanted it to, but we're here still leading the West. Actually, we're uh, leading the league, which is great. Um, if you like, I said, if you do enjoy it, be sure to leave a like. It's the King in the fourth quarter. Thanks so much.